Hey folks, it's Grimwit from Natch Evil. We're playing this again, and everything is laggy. So laggy. I'm not sure what causes the lag anymore. Alright, let's see what our objectives are. Whatever, whatever, whatever. We'll go ahead and take care of the pupil first, and um, I guess then we're going to talk to Izzy. Hmm. Hmm. Oh well. Uh, Miss Trimble's thing, her quest, as it were, is to, um, to basically go to the library. And, uh, you'll see by this side picture here that that's your clue that there's somebody hiding in the library. All we need to do is pass by this... What? I wasn't any... I wasn't near this! Why did you shush me instead of yelling, watch out? The library is a place for silence, not yelling. Okay... Sorry for disturbing you. I guess those books just jumped out at me. If only their content were so exciting. I'd be better off reading pop-up books. Ugh, emos. Eh, we'll ask. Then why are you reading them? Inspiration. Um, to cut yourself? I guess. <laughs> no luck? Luck is for children, as is this so-called literature. What do you need inspiration for anyway? For an escape? Something to set my poetry free? I suggest a change of scenery. Such as? Well, you're kind of pale. How about any place outside? Interesting. Pain is outside too. <laughs> Plus, there's a picture in this book of a vista that's supposed to be around here. Okay, just so you know, I'm goth, not emo. Wait, I've seen that. If only guardian angels were real then I might be able to find this place in the picture. Um... <laughs> no... Yeah, good luck with that. Yeah, that would be cool. I'd ask for help finding the vista, but no one helps anyone anymore. Mope much? Of course I'll help. What? I'll let you know what I find. I didn't agree! <laughs> but thou must! Alright, well, he's in our list now of objectives, which I will ignore. And this girl. That, that's really all there is. Not really. Trimble's looking for you. That's why I'm hiding. The longer you hide, the madder she gets. It's better if you turn yourself in than if she finds you. Not true. She may never find me. You're right. She'll find me. Okay, I'm going. Must not throttle child. Ugh. All right, let's see what we got here. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. no, I'm not gonna do the whole thing with Eugene. Um, mostly, I guess we need to find Izzy. That's the next step to getting into Petey's pants. Did I say Petey's pants? Hey, gossip time. Loading. Loading. Harper's rap is all wrong. She's as sweet and cuddly as a kitten. I'm not sure Chuck would agree with you. Who's Chuck? Why do I know Chuck? Somebody remind me who Chuck is. Oh, he's the basketball guy. I hardly pay attention to basketball, that's why. Hey, that's... Hey, Olivia. <clears throat> anyway. Back up, back up. Sure, we'll read this. Uh, okay. Apparently that got me a... <laughs> text! Oh. Um, you're welcome, Mom. Miss Trimble must have my mom, like, on speed dial or something. Okay? I guess? Emily wants a sleepover. I, sh I should be excited, but I'm more, like, scared. Well, it's on my calendar now, so that's a thing. I, I guess. If you double-click on it, it'll tell you what your events are on the days that they are on. Alright, we need to find Izzy. I don't like Izzy, but this is her right here. Hey, Izzy, I need to talk to you about... Whoa! Come back here! Wait, come back here! <laughs> I'm done talking to you! Um, Izzy, I think... In the original Let's Play, I kind of blamed her for all the crashes. Oh, okay, now she talks to me. I was going to run with her. Hey there. Hey. 
Uh, rudely, no. Beg for information. Beg. Beg! Get on your knees! Excuse me. Are you Izzy? That's me. I hear you're the expert on all things Petey. True dat. We've been friends forever. Do people say dat still? Huh. We'll try to be nice about... about Petey. To get in his, to get okay. In well, tell me this. Is it strange that he just shut me out? Not at all. I'd be surprised if he let you in. Why? Because he's getting ready for the DJ battle. He's really dedicated and doesn't like to be bothered, especially by new girls. No offense. None taken. I mean, you're a girl, too. No, no. It's a good spin. Well, have you heard his mix yet? Is it any good? Are you kidding me? No, why? Petey never lets anyone hear a mix before it's ready. He's too much of a perfectionist. Why does he do that? Because he's crazy. I keep telling him he is, but he's so caught up in his ways. That's my shy Petey. You take that back. Petey is not shy. Uh, push forward. So should I stay in the room until he kicks me out? Like a protest. I like it. Unfortunately, that might be the only way you get in. With Petey, you've got to be forceful, but gentle at the same time. It's a dangerous mix. Dangerous? How? Because if you're too forceful, he's going to get scared off. But if you're not forceful enough, he'll forget about you. Ouch. Not on purpose, but because the guy's so busy. Oh, whoa. Just be yourself, though. Petey likes honesty. Okay, thanks for everything. Yes, thanks for everything, Izzy. Alright, that updated our, uh, our quest log to get into Petey. Um, I'm trying to think, I guess. I mean, yeah, we could talk to Petey, but, um... Cool. Good luck. Let's play basketball first. <laughs> Alright, this is... You guys have seen this game before. Just hit the middle of the meter that goes back and forth. It's pretty simple. This is more text than it deserves, honestly. The thing is, um, you're going to notice this. While I was editing this, I decided to kind of speed up gradually. So you're going to notice that the video is going to speed up, but not the sound. All right, well, that aside... Um, I don't know why any mini game that you do in this game, uh, there, there's got to be a good reason for this. Any mini game that you do, there's money on the line. You don't lose money if you screw up. Um, hello? Hello? <laughs> God damn it, Izzy. I blame you for these crashes. You're the reason. All right, this is a, isn't too bad. We can just restart the mini game. It could have been worse. It could have been so much worse. Okay. Um, there's always money of the line on these uh, mini games. If you meet the metal requirements, I think it's just the metal requirements, it will... Um, God, this is so surreal. It will give you like $100 for bronze, $250 for silver, and I think $500 for gold. I've never been good at, enough at any of these mini games to be gold, but um, the original Let's Player, um, uh, Dyslexiac, that he he basically ruled these games. This went on and on, by the way, and so we're just gonna fast forward. There we go. Twelve versus ten. It doesn't matter how many times Izzy misses; it only matters how many times you miss, which is a little one-sided to me. Oh, no! <laughs> and then there's that noise. But it doesn't matter, because we got tons of money. Izzy paid us $100, and anything we can do to get Izzy to pay up is good by me. Golden, in fact. There we go. Oh, yeah. That was great! I should leave. I don't want to be the last one out of the school. And it just kicks us out of the school. While time ticks on by. Um, let's go to the promenade. Make a wish at the wishing well in the park. Who knows what might happen? Like, like Petey could crawl out. 
of the well and be like evil and stuff. I don't know. So you guys know the difference between emo and goth, right? Emo is very emotional and honestly a little bit whiny to me. Maybe it's just me. I don't I don't like emos. Goth isn't so much an attitude as it is an aesthetic. And they, they tend to be well, besides sacrilegious, um What's the word? Hey, there's a guy over there, that's a quest. We can check him out later. Hmm. Can't move this too far left or right. What? New, new quest? What? Oh. Oh, okay. We can see stuff at different times. We have a I fine guess. selection of accessories. In any case, um, cynical. That's the word I'd use. Cynical and sarcastic. Most emotions that start with S, other than sad. There are sad goths. I don't. I've never met one before, though. Oh, yeah, these glasses are the way to go. No, no, back up. We're getting the other glasses. Oh, yeah! And. I don't really see anything here that appeals to me. We already have the perfect ring that Pete is going to give us on our wedding day. Um, ooh, I like that. Yeah, it looks good. We'll do that. And, uh... uh no, nah, not really. Fortunately, the boyfriends don't care what kind of belt you wear. I'm not sure why not. No, no, no. Oh, here we go. Um... Yes. Thanks for shopping here. You're quite welcome. I guess. All right. Let's go talk to that guy on the on the bridge. He's got a quest. Hey, guy on the bridge. Excuse me, but you look like something's wrong. Oh man! <laughs> I got my sister's new camera case in the sea. She's gonna kill me. Um. At least it was just the case, not the camera. I'm sure she'll understand. It was an accident. No, she won't. It was the third one of hers I lost. You have to help. Can you bring me another one? How about fuck you? Sorry, but I don't really have time right now. I have my own real problems. <laughs> She's gonna be so <laughs> mad. I'll come back if you change your mind. Why don't you go play a rousing game of hide and go fuck yourself? <laughs> Got the look of that guy's face, though. Uh, well, we can't help him anyway. We don't have a leather whatever case. Anyway, over in the corner I saw some uh, dolphins. And there are the dolphins. And though I was really pleased that I saw these dolphins while I was recording, I forgot that I already got this. Like, I'm about to, I'm about to open up the phone, check the objectives, and see that, oh yeah... I already have this. Seems like I'm forgetting something. Ah, it doesn't matter. All right, promenade is pretty. Ooh, gossip. Promenade is pretty, uh, pretty simple. There's only really three kinds of locations. There's the uh, the docks. There's the accessory seller woman, and then there's ice cream. Even though it says gelato, this is clearly ice cream. Oh, I'm sorry, gelaterva. Mm. That was a waste of a dollar. Wee. All right. Let's send a message to, I guess, to Emily or. Oh yes, we'll send Petey a message. Petey, Petey, I'm bored. Petey, Petey, tell me something. Uh, wow, he messaged back quickly. Rollerblading in the park. We must go rollerblading in the park. Our, Our God, God commands it. it. Oh, Petey! Rollerblading in the park. Rollerblading in the park. Wee! <laughs> oh, there's something wrong with me, man. Uh, it is a new morning, Liz. We're oh. going rollerblading in the park. 
Oh man, I have way too much fun with these games. So, uh, drink aside, day rolls by, and uh, it doesn't matter what happens today, because whatever happens, it includes rollerblading. Cool. <laughs> oh man. One of the things, uh, one of the things about this game that always bugged me is there seems to be more attention on boyfriends than friends. So it should be boyfriends forever, I think. You know what I heard? Chuck forgot Chelsea Harper's birthday, and that's why she broke up with him. I can't blame her. Yeah, actually, yeah, it's, that's pretty much a dick move. I wouldn't do that to my wife. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh my god, what have I done? <laughs> or what have I not done? Speaking of breakups, there she is, there's Emily, she's passing by. What are you doing? Get that out of the way. Go go apologize to her. Ah, this is an example of what I'm talking about. You can't, like, a an actual friendship. Just, e even the minutest part of this is when you mess up, you apologize, right? Simple. Simple. You ask for forgiveness, you don't give any excuses. I mean, this is... I assume... Anyway, so yeah, we screwed up with Emily. And by we, I mean me. Because I was so hung up on rollerblading in the park. Okay. So here we are in the park. And, uh... Dealing with lag, as you do. And, uh, let's see if there's anything new going on here. Look at this mess. Say, can you help me stop some litter bugs? Bugs? Gross. Really? Not real bugs. Just people that have been throwing their trash. That's not very nice of them. Call the cops. I tried, but they're busy. But if you're not, maybe you could help me clean up. I'll pay a little something for every piece of litter you collect, plus a bonus for stray golf balls. Money? For free? Alright. Bless sure. my purple eyes. I like helping the environment. Great. So, I have a secret reason for this, and it's kind of dumb. Okay. You can't save this game. You have to wait through checkpoints of saving this game. Now watch in the corner, see where it says saving? Every time you pick up a piece of trash, it saves your game. Now there are 25 pieces of trash and 25 golf balls. Oh, I don't know how many magnets. Does it save if I pick up a nat magnet? No, it doesn't. But it saves when I pick up trash. So that's my secret way of saving the game. By finding a piece of litter and disposing of it. I, uh, I haven't run around this entire... This entire lake yet. Is this considered a lake or a pond? It's clearly artificial. I guess this is a pool. Yeah, this is a pool. Is that, is that the technical name? I don't know. I'm getting off track here. In any case, uh, things you can do. You can feed the fish. There we go. And we throw it away immediately. That was a waste of a dollar. More so than the ice cream. I could taste the ice cream. Here's the rollerblading. Give me a second. I need to save. Rollerblading in the park. Okay. <laughs> uh, at this particular time, I've got to apologize. The music for rollerblading was awesome. And instead you get this. Enjoy. Or suffer. Whatever. <laughs> uh, this game, um... All I've got to tell you is, if you go rollerblading in the park, for God's sake, don't hit a box. You hit one box, and your life is over. You, you will be ruined. Forever. You will have to... You will have to declare bankruptcy. You will sell your house. Petey will never love you. It's just boxes is horrible in this in this particular minigame. Other than that, it's pretty fun. And uh, 
It's got spinning skulls. It is. It can. It can. Uh, it can tout. It can. Uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, boast that it is the only mini game in the entire maxi game that has spinning skulls. Not. Not real sure. Oh god, I hit a box. I got really lucky. But, uh, man, <laughs> this is actually, I gotta admit, this is one of the more fun mini-games that they have. Uh, most of these games are kind of wimpy, that's a good way to put it. Whoops, I almost hit that box there. Uh, uh, you'll find out what happens when you really hit a box, so it, it basically stun locks you. Whee! Oh, two spinning skulls. Shit got serious, son. Whoops. While I'm uh, while I'm doing this, I have a side game to kind of test out with, and that was Grace Moody, which you may have noticed if you whoa whoa oh my god that was so close. You may have noticed if you uh, paid attention to the very first episode. There was a uh, another girl. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Moody is after Seth. I think Moody's got horrible taste in men, personally. It was just me. Okay, here, check this out. There's no way you can dodge these. Just once you hit one box, that is it. <laughs> No, stun lock. There's nothing you can do. You can't jump. You can't dodge. There's nothing. Nothing. <laughs> but it doesn't matter because I made enough money for the uh, for the goal. <laughs> oh man. Okay, hundred bucks because money is always on the line. We've got to find some way. Like if if we. Send her a message. Can we send her a message as apology? That would be nice. No. Okay, how are you? And I'm sorry. That's the best I can do. I can only commu communicate in three ways, Emily. Where are you? How are you? And I'm bored. So is she. Let's go visit her. Where is she? Back up, back up. I gotta remember how to send messages. No, you can't reply. There's no reply option. You can only send messages and receive them. Expect this to be easy? Phones aren't easy. There we go. Where are you? I suspect she's at the... Ooh, save point. I suspect she's at the mall. Yep. Okay, well, to the mall we go. When you go up to a boy, you always get the the option to talk to one of the six different boyfriends. When you have a girlfriend, not like that, when you have a girlfriend, you cannot talk to them. What gives? That's, that's just, I, I realize it Hello. might have been more work. Hey, I don't suppose you could help me with a survey, could you? There's $30 in it for you. Well, that's $30 buy back friendship. I need friendship. Sure, why not? Great. I just need you to ask a few of your fellow students what their favorite movies are. An excuse to talk to Emily. All right, let's do it. Let's find Emily. Ask her what her favorite movie Emily. Oh my god, Emily. I'm so glad I found you. Emily, look, I got the survey, and I'm sorry. Emily, don't treat me like that. Emily, please. Oh, I just got blanked. Ouch. I just got blanked. Oh, man! Uh, I need to talk to people to fill out a survey. You lady? No, not a high school student, I assume. I, don't, I can't tell, honestly. Everybody in this town is either a teenager or an elderly person. There's no in-between. There's never any in-between. Nobody seems to want to talk to me or my survey. I'm, I'm completely worthless, aren't I? There's, there's no reason for me to go on. Okay, see this? This is emo. This is what I'm talking about. That's the difference. Let's buy a gift for a dollar. Hmm. I wonder what it was. Let's check our handbag. 
Oh, we did have a leather camera case. <laughs> I forgot about that. And I guess it's uh, it's a surprise. Well, we'll find out later. Where could it be? Hmm. Olivia. Olivia. I need to talk. Oh, uh, what's her name? I forgot what her name was. Olivia, talk to me. What's her name? Talk to me. Your friends of Emily. Can you make up? Oh my God! They're, everybody is blanking me. This is the worst day of my life. And this is emo. Hmm. Ooh. Okay. Got a magnet just in case. And uh, if you ever get get the chance to go to the entire other end of the mall, you can ice skate. I don't feel like ice skating. I feel like apologizing. I'm gonna go home and mope. Maybe cut the grass. You! I don't want to talk to you again. Petey! Petey! Please, Petey! No! <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> Last thing before we go. It's Friday. Every Friday you get an allowance from Mom. She may lock you in your room for eternity, but uh, she does pay you. There we go. And she sends a little message that says, Honey, allowance. Hooray. I'll talk to you guys later. Next week. Oh, man. Drop my sister's new camera case. She's gonna...